getting ready to head off to college this fall and still not sure yet what you want to do when you grow up? Well, how about getting a PhD in chocolate? You probably think we're joking, but it's the real deal. The BBC reports it's all possible at the University of Cambridge through its Department of Chemical Engineering and Biotechnology. They're actually advertising for a PhD student to research this. So you can basically spend your whole time researching the non meltability of chocolate. Right. Okay. Wouldn't that be an amazing no, job? When you first hear about the program, you might imagine something similar to a real-life Willy Wonka in the chocolate factory, but it's not necessarily the case. Turns out there's plenty of science behind it. While Cambridge calls the program mainly experimental, the Independent reports it also says you need to be good at math and have studied sciences including physics, chemistry, or engineering for at least four years. As Metro comically writes, sadly, a long history of polishing off family-sized galaxy bars in front of Gossip Girl won't count as credentials. But enough about the requirements. What will a student actually do if they're selected? On the ad posted to its website, Cambridge says an applicant should find ways that chocolate can stay solid in warmer climates and keep its quality at the same time. The internship is fully paid for and would last three and a half years. No surprise, there are plenty of other odd majors out there, some of which The Telegraph has compiled into a list of majors you might not have heard of. The list includes a degree in making the perfect wine, a degree in brewing, a degree in the science of surfing, and one in so-called ethical hacking. If you're interested in applying for the internship, you don't have a lot of time. The application deadline is August 29th. The selected applicant, who also has to be from the EU, would most likely start studying in January. For Newsy, I'm Matt Moreno.